Hey guys, Monster 5 fam here with another video. Today I'm just gonna be just showing you guys my train set as you can see. It's my train set right here. Um I'm just gonna be having fun. You know, I'll just be switching locomotives and stuff like that. I'll I have my tripod set up for everything and like that. So I'm gonna turn here. That's that's some the leaders you gotta CSX GP40 and then a BNSF SC78. I'm just having fun, so don't mind this being there. I know you get like you rail fans usually see freight. You don't see freight on passenger, but I'm just gonna be have fun here. So I'm gonna sit down and get this train moving. So let's do that. There we go. By the way, if you guys are new here. Like and subscribe, click the bell, and so you don't miss anything from me. But let's just get started. Just, and we're gonna go pretty slow, and then we're gonna try and go fast. If they, cause sometimes things can go, things can go wrong. It's really cool. I'll go a little bit faster for you guys here. Come on, come on. Oh, we got it. Come on, this is the second time this happened today. Okay, let me move this. She derailed a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna stop. You guys are gonna watch me. Okay. The GP40 derailed. I'll fix that for you. Let's see. Oh, that's why. Down the rails this time. Rails are good. Yup. See the BNSF is good. Okay. Let's turn back here. Let's go. Something's wrong with that. I'll see what's derailing it. If it keeps doing that. But I don't see anything making it derail. Let's see what happens. Okay, that time I went through smoothly. Alright, I'll switch locomotives. So let's get here. I'm like I'll go around for you guys one last time. I'll just stop her for a little bit. I'm moving backwards a little bit. Alright, I'll do it one more time for you guys. Just one more time and then I'm gonna switch locomotives and probably put it on the back. Maybe. If you want to put me, put it there where the being the stuff is at. Just leave it on it. Guys, I got a question real quick. Whoever can get this right will get a shout out. What is my favorite train locomotive? If you guys can guess it, comment down below. Guess it right, I'll give you a shout out. But let's change this SC78 style and then move the, remove the GP40 to. All right, I'll show you guys what I have. So I got my, my Steelers right here. This one. You guys want me, I might use that one, or I'll use my Poor Express. I'm not going to pick it up, because it is right here. Or I can use my small steam locomotives. See, as you can see, all right, hold on. As you can see, right, it's small, there's a tender. But you know what, guys, just to make you happy, if you guys, I'm going to give you guys some sound. So, we're going to use the Polar Express, so let me just move these up here. I'll put the Polar Express on the tracks. I'm kind of sad because I wish I got the Pier Mark wet. I didn't have it online, so this is the closest I could get to it. The Polar Express, because they look identical. Just that this is Polar Express and Pier Mark wet. It's Pier Mark wet, so. Make sure she's on the tracks. Okay, let me check. Let's move this here. We should be good to go. Let's 
crank this up. Get a move on it. I know my traits are looks a little bit messy. I'm sorry for that, but let's get a move on. So that was my poor express. That was pretty. Hopefully, you guys like that. All right, we'll try something new later. We're gonna keep. We're gonna keep the poor express running for you guys, so you guys can just have some fun. Okay. This. Let's get it running again. See, she goes through the tunnel there. She comes out here. This is my only sound locomotive, by the way. Not until I get a sound uh, remote control. This is all I got. Later, do some laps on the tracks, and then if you guys really want me to, actually, you know what? Since you got, you guys probably want me to do this. I'll go full speed. Let's get it. down so you can get a good shot of her coming out of the tunnel.
Alrighty, let's stop her. Alright guys, so we're gonna switch locomotives again. We're gonna go with, I'll show you guys right now, this bad boy. Switch out the parks. I'll watch you guys. All I have to do is just pick her up. I'll stop this. That's all I have to do. On a couple. And then I'll pick her up nice and gently. Put her to the side. And now we're going to bring in the Steelers locomotive. Back up, couple up, and see how she does on the rails. Okay, she's on. Now we're gonna, you're going to watch her back her up. Bam. Tough test. Perfecto. By the way, this is my fastest locomotive. Not my strongest. But it's definitely my fastest. I'll tell you that. It's like it's like one of the Seahawks players, one of the fast ones. You know, like a running back like James Conner. But anyways, let's, let's give her a test run. Doing pretty well so far, so good, so far, so good. We're gonna let every engine lead by itself. So the first one was forks, but then we're gonna do or we're gonna steal this locomotive. Then we're gonna do uh what else should we do? We should do uh the CSX GP forty. I have a GP thirty eight, but okay, I'll show you guys once this makes a lot. I'll just go fast so I can show you what GP thirty eight is like. I told you, my fast engine. Look at this thing. I have to slow down real quick. Yeah, I told you guys, that is my fastest engine. But let me show you my GP38 real quick. Okay. Take you off. Here's my GP38. Right here. CSX. I'm gonna do it backwards, then I'm gonna do it forwards. So it's, is this. Okay. Alright, yeah. I'm sure. Okay. She works pretty well, but here, here's the problem. That's the problem right there. I don't know what's wrong with it, but. It just makes that noise, and I can't do anything about it. But it's a pretty strong locomotive. I'll, I'll tell you that, guys. She comes coming around the band. She is really loud, so I'm going to get her off the tracks. All right, we're going to do my GP40, which is better than the GP38. Well, actually, I'll do fours for you guys. I'll just do fours, the GP38 for you guys. You guys really want to do that? I will. There we go. Pull up. And let's, let's just get it. Super bad engine. Yeah, that's what she sounds like. Okay. We're gonna take her off. Now we're gonna do the GP40 backwards and forwards. Okay. So my GP40. Actually, let me show you guys. This is my GP40. Looks like the GP38, but it doesn't make that noise. Let's just put her on backwards. Okay. She's connected. Oh, wait, not yet, guys. But now she is. All right. Let's give her a test run.
We're just gonna get through this quickly, cause. All right, let's go see our full speed. Not too fast, but it's pretty good speed. All right, so one more lap, nice and slowly. Looks nice, doesn't it, guys? Okay, just gonna zoom out. Alrighty, all right, stopped her. Now, let's put her on Fords. Here we go. I'll zoom in for you guys just for the first part. Full speed. All right, one more time. Go full speed. Okay. Hmm. All right, let's do my steam locomotive. Hopefully, I might add a C the CSX GP40 just because it's my weakest engine out of all of them but it's a small steam locomotive so I think you guys would get the get why it's so hard for it to just pull kind of long of a train I built I kind of connected it but oh she might actually make it let's see yep I knew it all right we're going to add the GP40 to help it. Give it a little extra push. Since it's, um, since it can't pull its own train. Because I feel like ruining this train because I usually like this combo. Alright, let me just zoom in or turn the tripod. Alright, the GP40. Give it the steam with those extra push it needs. We should be saying, let's try this again. Oh, not backwards. <laughs> oh. Forwards, go. Let's try this again. All right, let's see how it does. That's much better. There you go. That's so much better. I'm not gonna do full speed though, because when it has two engines, it sometimes can derail. I'm not taking, I'm not taking any chances of rigging my model trains. Here she goes. Yup, looks awesome, guys. All right, let's see. What, I'll try full speed if it messes up. Oh well. Let's do this. Woo! Okay. Well, she's full speed. Oh, it's not messing up, okay. Maybe she's slowing down a little bit. Ooh, okay. We'll stop her here. Take you off. See you look at mode. We saw what she can do. Take you off now. We're going to do my favorite locomotive and my most expensive. The BNSF SC70s. I'll show you guys. That's it. Yep. 
it's really long. It's really long. Here's the front. It's a number. It's 8453. Put it on the rails. Yeah. Put on the rails. Okay. Let's back her up. There it goes. Up test. Perfect. Let's get her moving. Zoom in for you guys. Just like so. Oh yeah, that looks sick, guys. Look at that. Uh, the NSF looks so cool. I will be ending here soon so I can do some other stuff I need to do. But yeah, I'll go full speed in a second because we have to go backwards too for this. And then that's my last locomotive I'm doing because that's all the locomotives I have. Alright, let's go full speed. It's not too fast. It's not as fast as everyone, but this is, I should have mentioned this, this is my strongest locomotive. This is my strongest. It might be slow, but that slow has power in it. Like, it is so powerful, dude. I've tried at a train club, and this thing can pull hard. It could pull a 22-car coal train. That is, that's nuts. I tried it, and it worked. I didn't go that fast as this, but it definitely pulled it. Alrighty, let's try it backwards now. Switch. Let me just. There we go. Let's turn her backwards. There we go. Let's go. Awesome. Uh oh, that's the first problem we had today. All right, what happened? Oh, the house. Okay, I'm trying again. Oh, the rail. Are you kidding? All right, so now you get to see me. I'll move the, the house is over here, so you guys can watch me. Yep, there, there it is. It derailed. Sadly, that's that's depressing, but. Yep, I'm gonna get up real quick and fix it. Okay. Wait, let me show you guys can. Yeah, you guys see it. Okay. It's over here. Okay, well, I see what happened. It kind of slipped off the rail, as you can see right here. So, all we have to do is just of that. Oh yeah, we gotta bring it. Yeah, this engine since it's so long, it doesn't do so great with turns. So I'm gonna. Oh, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. Hmm. One second, guys. Just trying to flex it. Then down. This thing is really giving me a hard time. Okay. Let's go like that and then back. Oh, there we go. I think that worked. Dang it. I'm trying, guys, for you guys. I know you guys haven't requested a uh, a little train set, but 
I want you guys, I just want to show you guys all my good locomotives. Or, I, I, these are all the locomotives I have, I should say. Expose myself. Huh. Alright. Okay. Do that backwards. And then do that. There we go. And connect it. Now, I'm going to move the houses back. And now, we should be good. Let's, let's test her. Hopefully this works. Whoa! Oh, I see the problem. This house is way too close. There we go. There we go. Okay, well, I can't... I could try this now. Hold on. Give me one second, guys, and I'll see if this works. We're coupling it to the back. See what happens, see if it works, I don't know. But we'll, we'll see. There we go. Oh, whatever. Oh, dang it. Car always has a problem. Should I hold? That should hold. Yeah, it didn't hold. Yeah, it's not holding. So that's what I could do is just remove that. And then, connect that to that. And now let's try it. Ah, that's better. Yep, no really problems. So far, so good. Okay, guys. Just zoom in. It's almost a 30 minute video by the way, so yeah. It's been fun hanging out, playing my train set, but let's go full speed. Like I said, not too fast, but it's getting there. Woo! Yeah, yeah. Alright. I'm gonna stop here for the day. Cause I am tired from school, but guys, you already know the model. Like, subscribe, comment. If you want to, please turn on the notification bell after you subscribe. I will see you guys later this weekend when I go rail fanning. That's an announcement, by the way. Peace out.